Looks like your man, little largey. 1847 braided hair, large set. And we got a 1966. All right, bring you back in. It looks like I got a two center. Yep, there it is, two cent. Oh yeah, that is a walker. Yeah. Just pop the copper out. Let's see what we got. All right, another Benji. 1845. That is an awesome find. I will take that. We will see you on the next one. Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Rick from Hunting Southwest Ohio. I'm going to try again with some dimes. I was working at it for quite a while and could get nothing but uncirculated boxes for months and months and months. Got shorted a few half dollar boxes this week, so I figured I'd ask they had one. So, we're going to try it, see what happens. I'm going to get into this box of dimes, see what we find, and I will bring you back when we run across that first find. Roll number eight the dime box and it's not the greatest find but I'm gonna hang on to it a 2009 P dime these are definitely low minage if you look over here in the book 2009 P's 96.5 million 2009 D's 49 and a half million you look the year after it was 557 million the year before, 391 and 624. So it is definitely a low minute coin like the other 09. So I'll be hanging on to that. See you on the next find. Rule 20 of this dime box. And guys, I missed it. You can hear it. It really didn't have that silver looking edge. It's kind of clad looking. But. We got a 1964. First silver out of a dime box. Finally. Pretty awesome. See you on the next one. Roll 31. And underneath the scope, we have a 1970 Philly. And if we flip this over, you can see right there on the torch, got these extra lines right here. This is going to be a 1970p proof reverse and this is the book that I use get rich with pocket change and you can see right there 1970 proof style reverse and there is exactly what we're looking at this would be the common version there is no lines in the torch at all like there is right up here got them lines going through it which is exactly what we have right there. So, we've got a 1970 Philly, proof reverse, circulated condition. This is about $10 to $15, so I'll take that. Great find. See you on the next one. Rule 37. And we got another one right there. And it's going to be another 19, 64, I can't tell. Oh, 1946. First year. Very nice. Two silver dimes in the box. My eyes are bugging out already, so bear with me. I can't even hardly read dates. All right, cool. See you on the next find. Roll 46. And we've got another 09. This is a low minage 2009D, just over 46 million, I believe it is. Very nice. I'll take that. All right, the dime box is hunted, and it was a great hunt. I was concerned I'd have to pick up another one to add to this, but very, very happy with the results. So here's a quick wrap up. We got a 2009P and D, both low minage. I'll take both of those for sure. And we got that 1970p proof reverse. Got some detail on the flame. So that's a fir first time find for me. Happy to have that. And we got lucky enough to get a couple silvers. First year, Roosevelt, 
and last year a 46 and a 64 so what an awesome hunt finally get a circulated vine dime box and finally get some good finds so i've been at this for a long time and dimes have eluded me i've been uncirculated boxes forever and ever so pretty cool so a couple silver dimes we get to add those to the silver jar all right appreciate everybody coming along give it a big thumbs up hit that subscribe button and we will see you on the next hunt.